In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to create a light wrap in Fusion. While Fusion doesn't have a dedicated light wrap node like Nuke, that doesn't mean you can't achieve the same effect. You just need to set it up yourself. First, you'll need both the alpha channel and a background image. For this demo, I'm using a photo from Pixabay and green screen footage that I've already keyed out from the Action VFX practice footage library. Next, we need to create the outlines of the character. To do this, we'll use a bitmap node. You'll need two nodes. Connect both to the alpha of your subject, then mask one node with the other. Change the paint mode to multiply and invert the other node. This will generate the outlines. You can expand those outlines by adjusting the soft edge. If you notice any issues, it might be due to the clipping mode. Set the clipping mode to frame, and that should resolve it. Now let's merge your background and mask it with the alpha you created. This may give you a weird effect, but we can fix that with a blur node. At this point, you have your light wrap, but it's affecting the whole character. We want it to be visible only in the highlights. To achieve this, you can use the Luma key to isolate the bright areas in the background. It might actually work better if you add the blur node after the Luma key. Now, your light wrap will only appear in the bright areas. You can fine tune this using the key and adjust the blend slider in the merge node to control the amount of light wrap you want. Another option for creating a light wrap is using a tool called ML Light Wrap by Emilio Sapia. If you connect your alpha to this light wrap tool, it'll produce a similar effect to what we made with the bitmap nodes. You can control the spread and gain to determine how much light wrap you want. Connect this to the merge node just like we did before. You can find this macro in the reactor. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.